don't really care for this the new VB. I miss the old VB. I feel like she to me I feel like she basically feels like the old VB again. Like it yeah. wasn't quite so drastic. She's pretty much as last there. Week. Yeah. She's pretty much there. She will be next episode, I'm sure. <laughs> oh man, but how about the ending though? Oh, no. You thought man, it was me, Ophelia, but it was me, <laughs> Antonio. <laughs> it was like me, Dio. And it's just like, oh god. Like again, oh, this is another one of those shows. Coming. So this is another one of those shows. I need next week to come by so I can see the next episode. Like, God, these cliffhangers. Like, oh, that, that guy definitely looks like an, like an Antonio. I was, I just, I was like, just what? At the end, just I don't know. Like it just threw off everything that I thought was gonna happen this episode. So yeah, I'm really tired. Like. I don't think that's the, that you know that younger looking dude um, is like that main Team Rocket villain that we've been seeing like every episode. Yeah, I was I gonna ask that. Do we know who that is? Because didn't Matsumoto no. like say his name when he saw him? Well, I think I think they I think Vivi he's just gonna, they're they're both just getting vibes from the older guy because there's uh-huh. there's no way like he just looks that young unless he yeah. like AI'd himself in a sense if that happens I don't know. And that's I know really there was the, the, the whole scenes too where like only Vivi was seeing him. On like the and when Matsumoto was looking at like the security cams, he couldn't see them. So I don't know if it's like just something in Vivi's head that she's kind mm. of fabricating, or yeah. well, apparently uh, he knows he who hacking. she is. He was hacking too, and I know that that's not the same way that he was. Oh, using true, the true, like, true, true. But it's for the other one, but he could have been mm. fucking around with hacking as well. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Maybe somebody that went back in the past too. Maybe he time traveled. Mm-hmm. Who knows. Did yeah. you guys watch like yeah. the ending? Like, uh, there was actually something after after the credits too. I don't know if you yeah. all watched it. Yeah, oh, was it? I, didn't, oh, I, didn't, I didn't watch it. Uh, well, I mean, okay. it's just like oh, okay. It was uh, it was basically like the, was his it... piano teacher saving a bunch of people from the fire. Yeah, from a fire, and then he blew up. Okay, in, I, uh, like, I thought that was like I thought yeah. that was during the episode, part of the episode. I didn't remember that was the end or not, but that was after the credits. Yeah, I okay. think that was. I think it was a part yeah. after the credits. Yeah, okay, that was mm. after the credits. Yeah, but oh, okay. I don't know. Uh, I I think the show's still doing a lot of things well, but it, it definitely has dropped down in terms of like my personal ranking of shows this season. Yeah. Well, um, it, it just just like how they're doing everything, it just feels fairly rushed. Because I mean, they're doing crazy time skips. <laughs> uh, also, I kind of want to know what what Vivi did to herself <laughs> in like the previous one. Because yeah, it seemed like she she, she shooting herself? out herself, right? Yeah, yeah. She, she had, seemed like, like she like actually the uh, side of her face. Yeah. It seemed like that was basically kind of like the the whole thing, and then it seemed like Matsumoto brought her back to, to an extent. Least it played a part in it, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. somehow. But I mean, it, would, kinda, it would make sense, yeah. I actually kind of liked that because it made like his actions make more sense for me. Over the last couple episodes, like why he really didn't want to involve her, is it because he actually just cares about her, or is it because he thinks mm. that she's a liability, or both? I think the latter. You could do both. Yeah, the latter. Yeah, you're right. He's pretty mission focused. But, but then I don't... Like trying to like compare them to like Ophelia and um, Antonio, I felt like like I felt like they were trying to parallel compare them this mm. episode. So I wasn't sure if we were supposed mm. to be thinking that he does have some emotions for Vivi or not. I don't know. Because Antonio seemed like he was like put uh, with the little flashback with Ophelia where he uh-huh. seemed like he was good, even though he was like angry as all hell. But I feel mm. like uh, somebody else would have like maybe took over her Ophelia because it. Well, it's kind of like what you guys mentioned earlier. Like, if it was a comparison between Matsumoto and Vivi versus Ophelia and Antonio, like, Antonio seems like the type of friend who would be like, you know, yeah, man, you got this. Like, I believe you. And then they would be the one that stabbed you in your back. Like, they wouldn't say anything to bring you down or, like, they wouldn't be honest with you, right? They'll just be like your yes man. But then Matsumoto is the one that, that really does care. But because he cares, he's more stern or strict on her. Uh, so I feel like if you want to do a comparison, that's that's the vibe that I'm getting. Like Matsumoto is actually a good guy and he cares, but because of that, he he acts the way he does. And Antonio is just fake. And like once he got the oppor- it got the opportunity to hack into Ophelia's body, like he just took that opportunity so he can like become her and just like uh, like reap into uh, like the fame and fortune of being Ophelia, I guess. So oh, a couple couple things like you know one like you know why and how did he. Uh, hack into affiliate another one like why would he then jump off the building as affiliate uh i don't know yeah i didn't get those vibes at all of him like secretly wanting her fame and fortune or him like trying to um I, like him being a fake friend or something like that i definitely mm-hmm. I, at least maybe i was i was like paying like 80 percent attention during this episode maybe uh-huh. eight maybe 85 percent so I might have just like missed some subtext, but for mm-hmm. me, it definitely oh. just felt like he was more of like the, 
like the almost like a tiger parent kind of right like a little kind mm. of harsh on her um but uh, out of caring you know what i mean yeah i yeah i agree mm. more with taylor i don't really see him as like the fake parent i feel like it's more like maybe like he's i feel like the way he got into the body was like a mistake so i yeah. feel like he was like he's trying mm, to live up yeah. to Ooh. to her Is like I feel like, like he's, he's trying to love to her mission, and then th- th- when he has experience suicide, it's because he can't like take being her anymore, like because it's not his mission to be a song just AI. So that's what I took it as. Ooh. Yeah, man, I don't know. Good. Well, next yeah, week's episode, all... they better clarify that thing. Oh, yeah. To me, it felt like she he he forced himself to take over the body, like it was against her will. Yeah, or, so, or that's how that's, we're supposed to perceive it as a right. As so a, that, that that's my take on it, you know. Yeah. So, so. yeah, oh, good actually. Too. Yeah, solid. Um, I went back and looked at the beginning of the episode, and you can actually, like, there's scenes where you can foretell, like, Antonio and Ophelia in, like, the opening when they're showing the different timelines. So this is a show that, like, after it's all said and done, I'm sure there's a lot of stuff in that opening that, like, if you were to freeze frame stuff, there's a lot of potential spoilers. <laughs> uh, I mean, that's the... So, you know not to do, do it, it but, but just because I was trying to remember that. stuff, I went back and then I saw a scene where they show uh, Ophelia after she had, like, jumped and uh-huh. they show Antonio's body, like, holding her hand. It's, like, quickly flashing in. Mm. 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 I do think that scene where it was revealed that he is in her body was pretty corny. Like, the way they revealed that, I I, I laughed. I was like, okay. (laughs) And I am in her body. I am Antonio. Super over the top. It it only seems really corny corny is because the the AI's name is Antonio. You know, this is... (laughs) Is it that or Ophelia hit, hit like, puberty, right? And she got that deep voice change? I was like, ooh, well then. (laughs) (laughs) I mean... Could always have that a little bit more of a futuristic name, you know? Oh yeah, I guess. I guess. <laughs> no, I like I like the name uh, Antonio for him. Uh, nah, nah. <laughs> no. I, I'm I'm good. That's like it's like when when Japanese people give like these uh like uh like these important looking characters like English names like it just doesn't fit right. I like it. Like, uh, what about uh, Edward uh, Elric? Uh, I mean that's fine because that was like before I was like more aware or like uh I would say a good one is up to uh, that. um I'm a spider so what the head guy's name of the church being Dustin I yeah, feel like that's Dustin. like a weird like oh, okay you couldn't think of some like you know Roman Catholic type of relations like nah this guy's name's Dustin or like in uh <laughs> I can't take it in, seriously <laughs> or like in Mushoku Tensei like one of the one of the guys in that that demon group the the trio demon group of kids like one of the the demon's name was like was the English name like Kyle or Greg or something like that yeah. like the other the other two guys had demonic names and then this guy's name is Greg it's like hey, man. Culturally expand out there, but yeah. it's not not quite hitting the mark. Like, where the fuck yeah. does that come from? They're, they're I don't trying, know. though. They're trying. Yeah, I love it. But anyway, I have really nothing else for Vivi. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Again. that's it for Vivi. We so, need uh, we need next week's episode to to clarify some things. Yeah, but, I, like uh, I think it should it, it, I because get, I think next episode is like the wrap up. Like mm-hmm. again, uh, another one of these shows that I need next week's episode.